Hi everyone, my name is Emily, and today I w I'm going to talk to you about what I think is wrong when people say a woman is being objectified. Because I think nowadays sometimes when they say a woman is being objectified, they're actually saying, they're actually telling her that what to do and what not to do, and they're setting rules and standards for women to follow to meet the social expectations. So uh, let's just see a very graphic example of Miley Cyrus' performance on BMA last year. I assume you have already seen it. So, uh, so this received a lot of harsh critics saying that she is slut, a whore, or a bitch. I'm not supposed to say this word, but... <laughs> and uh, saying that she is objectifying herself and women. And my question is, why is the performance of female sexuality makes a woman slut? Uh, that means when, when women show their uh, sexual desire, people, people think they're slutty. And uh, social, these social law, sociologists, sociologists uh, Stanley Cohen have an uh, explanation about this in his theory of folk devils and moral panics. It means that um, when a person in our society, his, when her action challenge the, the values and rules in our society, we tend to use the mass, the mass media, the mainstream media to make her, to condemn her and make her a folk devil, to protect the values of our society. And in this case, I mean the patriarchy society. So, uh, when you go deeper in this issue, you'll see that it is, it is not actually just a problem about how many clothes you put on, but it's a problem about what roles do we expect men and women to play differently in sex. Uh, <clears throat> which also explains why Robin Thicke, this, this guy, received much lesser critique than Miley. And uh, men, because men are considered to be the subject in sex, are in our in our culture, and their sexuality performance are easier to be accepted. Accepted, while women are considered the object. We don't expect women to be aggressive in sex, and also they have this problem, this uh, myth of chastity, which uh, men don't have. And another feminism researcher, Sarah Marcus, described Miley's performance as a willful, willful parody of herself, of BMA conventions and demands on female performers, and even her fellow performer, Robin Biggs. So I guess you just have to, in, at the end of the day, you just have to go back to the question that is, when we are saying a woman is being objectified, are we really moving on to achieve the sexual equality, the sex equality, or are we actually confining the freedom and the right for women to decide for themselves and are we are we actually consolidating the frame of patriarchy society values think about it thanks